Hello, you are welcome to this video and in this tutorial what we are simply going to do is to create an animated slideshow that can be used for Instagram story and Instagram reel and every step needed to create this will be explained in this video. Also, if this is your first time seeing my face, you are welcome to this channel. Help me get to 100,000 subscribers by hitting on the subscribe button, okay? And just in case you're on the free version of Canva, I have a link in the description box below that can help you sign up or upgrade to Canva Pro for free. So yes, let's dive straight into it. Alright, so the first thing we are simply going to do is to come to create a design and make sure you are searching for Instagram stories. So click on it and everything should be loaded. And I must also say that I have a lot of Canva templates, but I'll show you how to find these templates at the end of this tutorial. Hey bro, come on now dog. Come on, man. Okay, so please make sure you're sticking to the end of this so you can also learn how to create what I'm about to show you. Okay, so once you have it loaded like this, the first thing we are going to do is to come to Elements. Okay, in Element, you can search for any video at all. So I'll search for maybe wildlife. Okay, so wildlife, and I'll just smash on the enter button. Then I'll come to videos. Okay, in videos, I can choose any video of my choice. Then make sure you are making the video cover the entire canvas okay so something like this is fine then you can just crop it okay just to make sure um, your video isn't looking weird okay so this is my first video the next thing we are simply going to do is to press r on my keyboard and make sure you're also pressing r on your keyboard just in case your r is missing or your r is still enjoying vacation or something all you simply need to do is to come to elements again just click it and come to shapes you can choose the shape okay and you have it here okay so let me just delete this and click on you know this one so make sure you have your shape selected come to the border style and click on the line border okay then come to color in color make sure you're setting the color to no color okay this should give you something like this then come back to your border style and the weight you can increase it okay to anything of your choice any size of your choice but we'll keep mine like this you know and it shouldn't be too big okay because there's a reason okay so i'll keep mine here and to the center then i'll come to the border color and i'll set it to white okay so this is what we have and i'll press t on my keyboard to add a text okay so i'll increase the text and i can see nature is amazing okay nature is amazing okay so this is what i'm just going to say select or come to the font section then i'll just change it to any font of my choice so i'll just choose lee gothic okay so and make it big something like this I'll come to position and make sure it's positioned, okay? Then let's make sure my shape is also, yeah, centered, okay? Then the color, we want to make sure it's visible. So come to the color and set this one also to white, okay? This is beautiful, all right? So this is what we've been able to create. And let me just crop, you know, this a little bit, yeah, the size. Yeah, so this is what we've been able to create and it's basic and simple. So the next thing we are going to do is to add our lines, okay? So let me just show you how you can do that. Press R on your keyboard again for a line, okay? And make sure this is on top of every element to make sure, right click, come to layer and come to show layers, okay? then drag it to the top okay something like this then we'll just make sure we are resizing it like this okay then drag it all the way to a snips you know to the center okay lovely then duplicate it using ctrl d and make sure you're snapping it next to each other okay then duplicate it again so you need five lines okay so you can see five lines that's all we need then select all and duplicate it and just drag and drop everything here so you can see what we also have okay very very nice now that we've done this the next thing to do is to duplicate the page okay so we would come to this section make sure the page is selected and duplicate it okay so we have something like this now on this page what we are going to do here is to make sure it's selected come to the lines okay then you can drag it down like i'm doing don't move it like this else it wouldn't the animation wouldn't happen okay so just click and resize it like this and you can create any style you want okay i'm just going to create the staircase um, style okay so you can do it any way you want okay okay so you can see how we have it over here let me drag it. yeah then i'll do the same for the ones on top so like this then i'll pull this one also up and i'll pull this one also here and like this and like that okay 
yeah lovely jubbly now i think one thing we missed to you know to do is changing the color of the line i want it to be white so i'll just select everything here come to the color and i'll set it to white and i'll do the same for this one as well we would set it to white then come here select everything set it to white and select everything here and set it to white so this is what we have at the moment okay so we are going to see how to animate the first two pages then we duplicate it so that we can change videos or pictures okay so let's see how to do it so once you are here make sure you are hovering in between the two pages you should see transition okay so click on transition then come to match and move okay when you select it then you come to duration and move it to the full seconds okay uh -huh. and make sure you're selecting the first page okay so once you select the first page you can play to see how the whole thing will look one eternity later it is really taking a lot of time okay so to fix this usually there should be the option to just resize the page but if you're not getting the option all you need to do is to come to magic switch okay and this is if you are on canva pro okay so if you are not on canva pro make sure you're using the instagram real dimension it will give you the video options okay so then come to social media okay social media and make sure you're clicking on instagram real then continue then make sure you're coming here okay resize this design okay so it's the same dimension just that it will give you the features so you can see what we have over here so we can just click and drag it something like this okay so i'll just drag it to like maybe one second or so okay so that when we play it doesn't stay too long on the first page then we have something like that okay so after we do that the next thing you want to do is to select this page the first page over here and duplicate it okay so you can move it behind the unveiling page okay so we have something like this okay so that at the end it will just close up but to make sure the animations happen again come to animation okay and come to match and move okay then you can just increase the duration okay so that's what you can do then duplicate this again okay then what we are going to do is to right click come to layer come to show layers okay so once you have this we are just going to select this page and we are going to delete it okay then we will come to videos again so here then i can just search for beds okay maybe beds so that we have some interesting beds then i'll come to videos choose any one maybe these flamingos and we'll increase the size okay to something like this then i will set it to the back okay or i'll move it to the back not set it to the back so we'll show layers then i'll move this all the way to the back okay so we have something like this then what we are going to do is to make sure we are decreasing the duration because this is just so that by the time it opens again we have a different video okay so then we duplicate it again okay then this is where we are going to unveil it again so we are going to do what we did initially all right all right so something like this okay yeah lovely job i hope it's easy to follow then we do the same for what we have over here amazing so this is what we have at the moment and on this page we can drag it a little bit then we come here and we can also drag this up now on this page okay what we can do is we can just select this and increase the size okay and we can also come here again you can decide to change the text or you can leave it the same way and increase the size as well and this is what we have at the moment so let's play it and let's see but first of all wait let me reduce the duration over here and also reduce the duration over here okay now let's play and see what we have at the moment okay so you saw how we have it in here okay so this is actually shorter so you can increase this and we'll just increase the duration okay so because the duration of this video was shorter the duration was also very short okay but once we increase the duration it also helps us to increase the duration of the videos okay so come here and i think the next video actually impacts the first video so let's play it again and let's see what we have
Okay, so I think one more thing we have to do is because these two pages are closed, we can just remove the transition from here. Okay, yeah, so that this is the only side that would have the transition. Okay, so maybe something like this. All right, then we increase the size. Okay, then this is what we have again. So you can see how beautiful it is. Then we can just come here and just to see how it will close. Lovely, javly. So you can see how everything is looking. So what you can also do is you can maybe just delete this page, okay, if you don't want. So that will just be one page over here. So you can just play it and see how the whole thing is going to look like. Okay, so it closes then it opens and that is what we have been able to kit and i hope you found this helpful and one more thing you can do is to add some music to it so let's see how to do that okay so we can come into music okay so option for audios okay so you can scroll and see audios once you come in here you'd find so many audios in here let me pick my you know my headset okay so we can just play any of the audios in here Okay, no, this one is not nice. Well, let's, let me just search for Africa. Maybe it will give us some nice African um, audio. Okay. Okay, I think this one fits. So we just drag it here. And let me just pause it. Okay, so then I can just move it here. And this is what we have at the moment. Amazing. Lovely. Wow. So you can see how the whole thing looks like. And this is something easy we have been able to create inside of Canva. And I hope you found it very easy and simple to follow. And if you did, please hit on the like button and share this video with a Canva friend. The name is Benjamin. Always remember there is no limit to creativity. And I should see you in my next video.